tonight and went over there, saw that group, signed autographs for them, and took pictures. Now trying to hold on to this lead. Ball's inbounded to Brown. Stops, free throw line. Jay gets the bounce. LA within one. Within two, I beg your pardon. 73-71 our score. Clark has space, he's gonna let it fly, and she's gonna connect! Oh, Caitlin Clark, she waited to prime time to connect from deep. A big one there puts the fever up by five. What's social media gonna do now? Nurse can't answer there, that one was partially blocked, it looked like, by Clark. Step back, get your feet together, rotation. The Caitlin Clark effect. Thank you very much. Clark with that triple into double figures tonight. She's now got a double-double, 11 points, 10 boards, and eight helpers. It's those eight assists that really got the fever going here. And Her what, innate ability to pass the ball, Mary. Yeah, and what did she say to us? My sanctuary is playing basketball, getting on the court and just playing, and we're learning how to play together each and every day. We don't have any practices. Our shoot-arounds are our practices where we're learning new plays and we're learning how to work with each other. But they come in winless. Their reward tonight, get on a plane and head to Vegas. Tomorrow night, they will play Vegas. Yeah, they got a back-to-back -back in Vegas. Clark says our head coach from Iowa, Lisa Bluter, expected to be in attendance. The whole staff. And the whole staff going to be there as Clark takes on Kate Martin, her old college teammate for the first time yeah. in the W. Oh, high reunion. Five-point lead here for Indiana. First time, it seems, Clark has smiled all night, knocking down those triples here late. Maybe in a couple weeks. And they've been some big ones. All right, everybody up. Here we go. We need you to So LA now down by five with 27 seconds left. Nurse going to inbound it. On the floor with Hamby, Brown, Jackson, and Brink. The inbound to Hamby. Tries to work quickly. The kick out Nurse, quick three. Back heel, rebound Boston. Shot clock is dark. Sparks got a foul. And Nurse picks one up. Probably not the player you want to foul, though, if you're LA. Last two threes from Caitlin Clark. Get your tape measure out. Never get tired of watching that. So a timeout taken by Christy Sides here. That was actually the first foul in the last two minutes for the Sparks. So the next one will be free throws for Indiana. How about the resolve of this Fever team? I mean, 0-5, they've been knocking on the door. Their last two losses have been by a combined six points. You come in here tonight in front of 19,000 plus. Trail by 11 at intermission. What a second half. What did Aaliyah Boston say to Nikki Kay at halftime? We need stops, we need to limit paint touches, and we just need great team defense. And boy, have they delivered. Four players in double figures. If you're Kurt Miller and company, you're going to look at that drought to start the second half. 21 assists on 29 baskets for the Fever. 11-0 run for Indiana to start the second half. And that might be what you point to. And that's been a thing for the Sparks this it's, season it's in their pattern. losses. It's been big runs that the opposition has gone on. Shout out to our fantastic crew, Mark Shaw, producer Jerry Weinstein, our director Desiree Stone, our TD. On stats, Dougie Fresh, my man Doug Brown, Danita Davies, our stage manager. The rest of our fantastic crew here on ION tonight. What a game.
Caitlin Clark making her LA debut. Only time the Fever will be in Los Angeles this season. She talked about Kobe today, Shaq, LeBron, Lisa Leslie felt honored to play on this floor. She said it's the biggest arena she's ever been in. But also mentioned it doesn't take much to get excited playing in front of a crowd like this, anticipating what a great atmosphere it was going to be. And the numbers may not show it, but she definitely contributed to winning here tonight. With the double-double, 11 points, 10 boards, eight helpers. Mitchell was fouled, she'll be at the line. And if you're the Sparks, you can't help but to think of what could have been. They'll be back in action here on Sunday against Dallas. But 15 second half turnovers. Great first half efficiently, just four turnovers in the second half, just it's like night and day. And they had no turnovers in the first quarter. Which was somewhat of a marvel. But how about Kelsey Mitchell and just her game? She could score every time she touches it, but just her evolution and development as a a team player and what she contributed here in the second half, 18 points on the game. 18 points a game high. Kurt Miller going to take a reset timeout here. So on the reset timeout, not allowed to huddle, just advance the ball to the front court. 12 and five, tenths left in this one. Crowd still on its feet here. Nobody is left, which is incredible. Nurse looking to inbound it to Jackson. Got to get a shot up quickly here if you're L.A. Hamby in the lane. The fall away gets the bounce there, does Hamby. First points of the second half. And Clark just going to dribble this one out. Caitlin Clark in front of a national TV audience on a Friday night celebrates her first win.